American Horror Stories, Halloween, Chucky Season 3, and Horror Hound Indianapolis, all on this Friday edition of Spill the Guts. I like it spooky. <laughs> My name is Clint, and I am one half of the I Like a Spooky Horror podcast, reporting on the second half of your week, bringing you horror genre news just like I do every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, right here on Spill the Guts. The podcast also brings you a monthly Crackle and Redbox streaming app rundown and a feature show every other week, and this is one of those weeks as a new feature episode is set to release this Sunday. Stick around to the end of this News Blitz roundup to discover what we have in store for you next. As for today, it's Friday, August 18th, and this just in. First up, iHorror.com reports that American Horror Stories will bring forth its very special Halloween episode. In addition to the multiple single, although broad and all-encompassing in nature, themed seasons of American Horror Story, Its companion show, American Horror Stories, have brought us two seasons worth of anthology tales that explored driving killers, a killer Santa Claus, dolls, and even brought us back Alicia Silverstone. This year, it looks like the anthology series has more to offer with a four-episode Halloween event. So far, not much is known, and the teaser image is awesome, but may not be a hint of what is to come at all. Or is it? All that is being teased thus far is a cool image in this. Quote, Dark Twisted Tales are coming with a four-episode Halloween event from FX's American Horror Stories, premiering Thursday, October 26th, exclusively on Hulu. American Horror Story also recently teased its new season of Delicate, which I reported on here on the July 17th episode of Spill the Guts to get us excited about the new spooky adventures. So if this bite-sized Halloween event isn't enough, maybe the new season will be. Second story of the day comes to us from bloodydisgusting.com who reports that, well, we'll just let Chucky tell you for himself. And now, we take you to Hackensack, New Jersey for a special announcement. Who made this podium so fucking tall? I'm here to announce to you, dipshits, that season three of my show, Chucky, will return on October 4th. And I will not rest until every single one of you fuckers watch it. Now ask me some questions. Chucky, what is this season about? All I'll say is, DC is gonna get chucked up. (laughs) <laughs> With so much content out there, where can we watch the new season? I'm too big for only one platform, so my show's running on three. USA, Sci-Fi, and Pika. Next, Fast like Will Devin Sawa be returning as a new character? Who? Next question. Uh, how about how about Jennifer Tilly? Will she be back? Yes, you know, she always comes back. Really, right here, Chucky, 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 Chucky. What's your response to critics that say there have been way too many doll movies recently? I'd say, this is not a movie. I already did seven movies. This is a TV show. I'm sorry, Chucky, I didn't mean to What kind of a shitty question is that? I'm coming for you. (laughs) And it is that time once again to pause for station identification and hear from our podcast network, the PFPN. You're listening to the Prescribed Films Podcast Network, home to hundreds of hours of free podcast entertainment. The shows on this network all have a common goal, providing you with the best discussions about movies and other forms of entertainment media. The PFPN hopes to fill your ear holes with audio joy. Visit our website with links to all the other amazing shows at www.thepfpn.com. Thanks for listening.
Last story of the day is about the Horror Hound Horror Convention's return to where it all started, Indianapolis, Indiana. The three-day extravaganza, which includes the return of Mask Fest, sponsored by Trick or Treat Studios and Reynolds Advanced Materials, kicks off today, Friday, August 18th, and runs through Sunday, August 20th, at the Indiana Convention Center, located at 100 South Capitol Avenue. Guests for Horror Hound include Robert England, Lloyd Kaufman, Tom Holland, Steve Miner, Jason Patrick, Skeet Ulrich, a Nightmare on Elm Street 4 cast reunion, and many, many more. The show runs from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. on Friday, 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. on Saturday, and 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. on Sunday. Currently, VIP, Platinum, and Early Weekend Passes are sold out according to HorrorHound.com. Normal Friday, Sunday, and Weekend Passes are still available. For more information, click over to HorrorHound.com or maskfest.com. In addition to all of the festivities, I will be on hand, not vending with inkmirrors.com, my dumbass passed on getting a table, but hanging with the cast and crew of the Valentine Bluffs fan film, including the minor from the film, Chuck Ryan of Chuck Ryan Cosplay, who will be in costume and available for autographs and photo ops Saturday. A screening of the unofficial My Bloody Valentine sequel fan film, Valentine Bluffs, will also take place on Saturday at 11.30 a.m. in screening room B. (laughs) And that is a wrap on your Friday news. Don't forget that you can connect with the I Like It Spooky Horror Podcast on all mainstream social media platforms, me in person this weekend at Horror Hound in Indianapolis, and remember to subscribe wherever you get your podcasts so you never miss anything that we are constantly putting out for you, including the new feature episode set to release this Sunday where we discuss the Hammer House of Horrors television series from 1980. I hope to see some of you this weekend, and I will talk with you all again this coming Monday on another edition of Spill the Guts. Hey, what's wrong with you, man? Show some fucking respect for the dead, will ya?